Hello and welcome back to the 30th of December. In this video we're going to be talking about NFC, that's Near Field Communication. Essentially NFC is a much improved RFID system. It works in a similar way and what it does, in the case of Android Beam which I'm showing you here, it exchanges the Bluetooth pairing information. So it pairs Bluetooth by just touching the phones together like so. So I'm going to send this picture right back to my phone. So we touch the beam and the phones pair with each other and send this file over Bluetooth, just like that. Very little is sent over NFC because it's so low speed, but it's very simple. All we have to do is touch the phones together and they started exchanging information. So these have various uses. We have the Android Beam, which starts the Bluetooth pairing. I've seen it used for advertising. So you put your phone near it and it would send the advert through to you and there's even talk of this replacing QR codes, which, well, they're around, but they're not really used. But hey, we'll see where this goes. It's definitely a nice technology, and it's quite handy just to be able to send files, just tap and wait. So, some deeper specs of NFC for those of you that are interested. It operates at 13.56 MHz. It has a bandwidth of 424 kilobits per second. Setup time takes 0.1 second. That is the key feature of it. At least versus Bluetooth, which takes over six seconds, can, well, you can see why it's so used. But the bit rate of Bluetooth is 2.1 megabit. Compare that to NFC's 424 kilobit. You can see why it's gonna take over. It even supports cryptography, but not with RFID systems. And the range of NFC is under 20 centimeters. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe one video every day in December.